thank all of the community leaders for joining us this morning. When the mayor called, she was mayor-elect at the time, and she said that this was one of the things that she wanted to do on the first day of office. The whole issue of hate is, is one that I think has a common link to every person that's up here, either through their profession or through their passion. So we are excited with the prospect of having a compact to uh, eliminate hate. And the mayor's vision and support in that regard is something that we take very uh, uh, serious. So, Mayor, thank you for doing that. And with that, I'm going to turn it over to Carlos Cabrera with the ADL. Thank you so much, Don. Mayor Gallego, thank you so much for this moment. Um, in November, uh, at our Torch of Liberty event, we had a brief conversation about what it would mean for our community to be no place for hate. And you told me at that time that with it, within your first day of office that you would sign a pledge to um, end hate and extremism and bigotry in the city of Phoenix, and here we are today. Thank you so much for following through on your promise, and ADL looks forward to working with you. Wonderful. I'm Kate Gallego. Today is my first day serving as mayor of the city of Phoenix, and I'm honored to be here with so many community leaders who have been champions for a stronger Phoenix, a Phoenix that embraces everyone, regardless of how you choose to relig how you choose to worship, the color of your skin, who you choose to marry. We want a city that stands up for all of our residents, a welcoming city that says you should be able to ch chart your own path and be who you are. Um, I come into this office at a time when there is great there are great challenges throughout our country and our planet. We have just had a massacre in Christchurch in New Zealand, as well as some events closer to home. And we want to stand up and say that Phoenix will lead the way in solving these challenges, that we want to be a community that really embraces our diversity and that we stand up uh, against hate. So I appreciate the Anti-Defamation League and others who have helped lead the way on this particular issue. Uh, today, my first uh, proclamation, I will be signing and joining my mayors throughout the United States to combat hate, extremism, and bigot bigotry. Uh, this proclamation denounces all acts of hate wherever they occur and ensure public safety while protecting free speech and other basic constitutional rights, calling for fully resourced law enforcement and civil rights investigations of domestic terrorism and hate crimes, elevate and prioritize anti-bias and anti-hate programs in our nation's schools, celebrate diversity, promote inclusivity, and challenge bias, promote law enforcement training on responding to and reporting hate incidents, and encouraging residents in their communities to report hate incidents and crimes, maintain civil rights enforcement, and strengthen hate crime laws when necessary. So I hope that you will all do, uh, join me in moving forward on these important goals, and I want to thank you for covering this important event. My name is Charles Faniel. I'm the president of the NAACP for the state of Arizona. My name is Mike Fornelli. I'm the executive director of Phoenix Pride. Donna Johnson, Arizona ADL board chair. Carlos Galindo Elvira, ADL Arizona. Roy Tatum, president of the East Valley NAACP. Michael Williams, chair of the Phoenix Human Relations Commission. Dr. Vishal Verma, chief medical officer for Forsey Medical Group. Mohammed El Sharpaway, I'm the chairman of Arizona Muslim Police Advisory Board. Jody Leggett, I'm chair of the Phoenix Women's Commission and executive director of Planned Parenthood Advocates of Arizona. Rana Singh Sodi, uh, member of the Arizona Sikh community and also advisory board of Phoenix PD. Hi, my name is Isauro Gonzalez, uh, Izzy Gonzalez. I'm with the Minority Business Development Center, which is operated by the Arizona Hispanic Chamber of Commerce. And I'm Don Logan, Director of the City of Phoenix Equal Opportunity Department. We truly commend Mayor Kate Gallego for this initiative, and I think she is bringing the communities together, and this is the step in the right direction. And it is very much needed at this time of ours, so thank you. Thank you so much.